Welcome Snack Attackers, my name is Jason and I have another potentially fantastic product to review for you guys today. Now, yes, the beard is currently gone and the hair is uh, gone again. I've learned how to shave my own head, so uh, don't expect to see hair back unless some other reason has uh, brought that upon me. Uh, but the beard will be back, I grow the beard in and out over the seasons uh, a couple times. The main reason I got rid of the beard this time is uh, my, the last time I got headshots I was 18. I had a full head of hair and no beard. And most of the time I arrive at um, audition calls I have a beard and uh, no head of hair. So I was like, it's time to update and I want to do two sets of headshots, one with beard, one without. You know, it's a whole, this is the actor's industry business, you know, it, we, we don't need to get into all that. What we do need to get into is this product. Firstly, this is the first Triscuit product that is being reviewed because this is the first new flavor they've released in 2020. Secondly, I love Triscuits. I know a lot of people do not love Triscuits. I adore them. I love the texture. I love the flavor. And there's very few Triscuits that I, I would say I do not enjoy. Without further ado, let us show you what the product is. The brand new Triscuit Tatsiki flavored. Yeah. I uh, am super excited about this. Tatsiki is a cucumber yogurt sauce uh, found in most traditional Greek food. I love it. Uh, I grew up in a location that had a lot of Greek food and was very close to Greek town. So I... I'm so excited. One of my favorite salads is Greek salad. I know that that's not technically like super Grecian in like traditional sense, but uh, it's, you know, it's at all the Greek restaurants. So uh, I think it falls under this category. I have resolved instead of having the masses of receipts that are around me, I write the location and price on the box. Uh, I didn't have to tell you that, but then you would be like, why is he looking at the bottom of the box during this bit? Uh, so I did have to tell you that. This was purchased at Target for $2.89. Not too bad. Uh, I didn't see anyone talking about this, so I believe it to be new. Though, and it says new on it. <laughs> Uh, but no one was talking about this, so I was pretty excited, and I'm still very excited, and, uh, let's do this, let's do this, I'm so excited, I said I was excited, I'm so excited, I hope I didn't break all the, uh, crackers. Are Triscuits considered a cracker? I don't know. Wow, oh yeah, per six crackers, okay. What constitutes a cracker, like, is it the shape? Because it's, it's, yeah, what is it, I don't know. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, it smells like dill. And like something sour, like yogurt. I'm stoked. I got the plate here, so I'm gonna I'll put one on. But it just looks like a normal Triscuit. Oh, you can't even see it with the with the color of that plate. 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 Well, I guess that was a pointless endeavor. I'm not gonna move the box. Let's keep the box. Let's keep it. You stay here, buddy. You and me! You got moxie, kid! I'm gonna show you how to do it in show business! Don't you worry! I, I don't know what that was about. Let's give this a try. Three, two, one, snack attack. I do a little dance when I'm enjoying it. It's my tell. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. Let's go down the features. Frequently, things that are dill flavored end up tasting like pickles. You know, very acidic, very vinegary. This is sour, but that sour is definitely coming from the yogurt flavor. It's got this nice, pleasant sour. It has this almost effervescent with the cucumber rather than dill. It's, it's, there is dill there because it's a cucumber dill yogurt sauce. But all of it mixes so well into this amazing little package. It's so, so good. It is so good, guys. It is my new 
favorite Triscuit flavor. And how unfortunate, because the target I was at, firstly, was not advertising this. This was found um, at, oh, I guess I should have turned my phone's sound off. Uh, whoops. This was found on one of the end caps, and there was only one box. This box. And I grabbed it. I snagged it. No one else was going to get it. They'd have to fight me to the death for it. And I was ready. Especially for Tetsuki Triscuits. I'll fight anyone. And especially now that I know how good they are. These are my new favorite Triscuits. Triscuits, like I said, I just, I love Triscuits, man. I love Triscuits. One time I, um... When I was very young, I thought Wheat Thins and Triscuits were the same thing, and I bought a box- Because they both have that yellow! I don't know if Triscuits still does, I think they've gone to this more like, uh, gray. But they both used to have that yellow kind of box, and I grabbed, uh, Wheat Thins thinking they were Triscuits, and I opened them, and they were just bricks of stale card stock, and I was disappointed. But I'm not disappointed here. Let's get to the actual review. I told you a little bit about the flavor. Uh, it's fantastic. Obviously, the texture, I love Triscuits. This is getting, all the way from the top, a snack attack, yes, for certainty. What am I going to rate it out of 10, though? Oh, I think I need another one. I think I need another one to know. Mmm. Guys. Guys. Guys! It's a 9 out of 10! That's so good. Mmm. Made a regret eating the whole thing at the very end during this roundup bit. It's a 9 out of 10. But the question we ask around here is not, should I have eaten a full Triscuit right before this roundup? Ensuring that there will be crumbs flying the whole time. And I'm going to be having difficulty speaking because I'm still technically swallowing the Triscuit. Uh, no, the question we ask around here is, would I buy it again? And the answer is, of course I will. If I see these on a shelf again, you couldn't stop me. I'd like to see you try. Yeah? You feeling froggy? Jump. <laughs> Remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, all the fun YouTube stuff, and I'll see you in the next one.